Hello and welcome to Capacity Middle East Extra, powered by JSA. I am Dean Perrine of JSA, and we are coming at you live from the Grand Hyatt Dubai for, I believe, the last interview of the day, and a very special interview it's going to be. I have joining me right now uh, Miss Doha Amour. Doha is the founder of the Women in Data Center Association, which was founded quite literally two weeks ago. Exactly. And we are here to talk about it on International Women's Day. Isn't that amazing? It is amazing. <laughs> it's it's a, 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 a serendipitous moment. Yeah. It's, it's, it's our moment right now. And we're going to talk about the Women in Data Center Association. And we're going to talk about you as the founder. Are we ready to go? Yeah. Okay. Ready. All right. Doha, you didn't just do this for fun, did you? You did this because that you have a passion and you are you are uh, compassionate for uh, for your your gender and for the women in the in the data center industry. Is that correct? Absolutely. Um, thank you so much for the opportunity, and it's amazing to uh, make our first official announcements on International Women's Day, and to be here in Dubai on Capacity Middle East. It's uh, a tremendous opportunity. Um, so I've been myself in the industry for about six years now, mm -hmm. um, and I think it's uh, about time to have a Women in Data Center Ask Association. Yep. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah. Um, and so. Our industry is booming. Uh, there is tremendous growth, um, but we're still actually lacking uh, any uh, real action plans to actually narrow the gap on gender diversity um, in our industry. Um, so the main motivations for uh, this initiative were actually two. So the first one is actually there is a tremendous lack of data on uh, gender equality in data center. So it's usually um, linked with the ICT sector. So we are part of the ICT sector. But I think everyone noticed that on data center, particularly if you compare it to telecommunication mm -hmm. or cloud, mm -hmm. the gender gap is wider. Sure. Um, so this is why with my co-founders, we wanted to actually have a focus on data center industry and take advantage of uh, the growth that the industry is experiencing uh, that we believe will be a real opportunity to uh, fix the gap mm -hmm. and hire more women. Um, so these are the main motivations, actually, for why uh, we are doing this. Okay. The motivations. I get it. Let's talk about the inspiration behind the motivation. I, I have spoken to probably a half dozen uh, female executives in the last two days, uh, which feels like a half dozen more than I have in, in previous yeah. years. This is a good thing. Um, every one of those women spoke about another woman in their past or their present as an inspiration to them. Do you have that inspiration? Yeah, I mean, I have uh, I have this imp inspiration, and I've been lucky. It's uh, in my family. Uh, my mother and my grandma are super powerful women, and mm -hmm. uh, they they uh, they empowered me also from a young age to pay attention to uh, uh, women causes. I mean, in general, wherever yeah. I am. Um, and so, since I joined this industry, uh, I couldn't help notice that. There's many things that we can <laughs> fix, and uh, we discussed this with many colleagues in the industry, not just uh, at the company or at a regional le level. There's also a lot of things that we can do internationally. Um, so, and in, in the industry, there is amazing, amazing role models yeah. that we don't speak about. And actually, one of the objectives of the association will be to create a platform to for advocacy. Uh, to show young girls and the new generation there is role models to follow mm -hmm. and to be inspired from. So it's actually one of the, the main objectives because sometimes I, I meet these women and they're, they're amazing. They're uh, actually managing their C-level CEOs, etc. Mm -hmm. But we don't talk about them much. Um, actually, uh, on the last Capacity magazine, you guys uh, put the spotlight on the 20 women to follow yeah. in the ICT sector. I found that amazing. And I think we need more initiatives like that. Yeah. I think we need to have you on the cover. 
Oh, <laughs> that's very nice of you. And I think I think we will uh, we'll definitely have to have this conversation a year from now, and we can talk about uh, the progress that you have made in the association, um, and uh, and continue to support uh, to support you and to support the Women in Data Center Association. Absolutely, absolutely. Thank you so much. You bet. Thanks it's for been being a here. pleasure. Thank you. Got you. you got it. And thank you, viewers, for watching. We'll see you soon.